Hey you guys, welcome to Kiki Nix. My name is Kalyani and today we're going to look at Mila Cosmetics Velvet Matte Lipsticks. So let's get straight into it. Okay, so Mila, also known as Sharmila, um, she's a very well-known makeup artist in Singapore and she also has her own skincare cosmetics line which is also known as Mila Cosmetics and um, for the purpose of this video, we're actually going to look specifically at her matte liquid lipsticks. I've heard good reviews about it so I can't wait to try it. I've not really tried it on my lips yet. Another thing is uh, when she released it this year, like earlier this year, like there were actually no proper swatches on darker skin tones. I think um, mostly because of COVID which is totally understandable. So I just got the four colours which I thought may be suitable for me and in case you guys are wondering how it looks on a darker skin tone uh, i'm actually an nc55 um, in mac so you can actually base it off there so let's just get straight into it and we'll get going okay first and foremost i like how simple and classy the packaging is it's just this um black hazing and you can see mila cosmetics here and here it says velvet matte lipstick okay so the net weight of each um, lipstick is 8 milliliters 8 ml and if you look at the actual lipstick packaging it's very beautiful it has a gold handle with a frosty glass so they can see the color and i also like how the applicator is um, it's slightly bent and it's also soft and actually easy to apply on the lips. So basically what's stated in the website is they are super long lasting without drying out the lips or feathering. The formula is lightweight, soft and smooth. It has vitamin E, it's kiss proof, transfer proof and smudge proof. So we'll see. Okay so the very first colour that caught my eye was fresh and this is how it looks. love this if you're a very pinkish purpley person you would actually love this and this is how it looks once you apply it um i'm just going to give it a minute or two to dry and then i'll be back okay so i'm actually truly loving this color and usually when i get lipsticks lipsticks yeah usually when i get lipsticks this is the kind of color that i gravitate towards and most of the time it doesn't go wrong and this is just a perfect example like it looks so good you don't need a liner nothing you can just wear it and head out like that um, it's very light on the lips you don't feel like there's anything you know sometimes you feel like a powdery effect for velvet lipsticks this you don't feel anything it's very light like no stickiness nothing so now we're just actually going to put it to the test um, let's see how it transfers not much okay very minimal okay kiss test Pass. I don't see any transfer here so it's really good guys like it's um, you know like a very beautiful shade for darker skin tone so yeah up next I'm gonna try the nude lipstick and let's just see how it goes okay no this doesn't really suit my skin type and I just don't like how it looks after it dries yep nope no definitely not not this color the nude is not for darker skin tones you might want to make it work by using a, a lip liner it's possible but on its own um, I just don't like the aesthetics of it like it just doesn't look nice it's so patchy and you can see the lines on my lips so no okay so i decided to give it another go so what i did was i instead of just applying it immediately after opening it up i just removed some of the lip product and i applied the remaining on the lips so for this new shade it would be better if you actually do that and apply it and then you just smudge it you purse your lips and you smudge it it's a nice nude color even for a dark skinned person um, but it's not the best nude shade I've ever had and I'm still not liking the patchiness on it so okay so the third lip shade is salmon oh 
After application, this is how it looks and we're just going to give it a minute or two to let it fully dry and I'll come back. So we are going to give the transfer test another go. No transfer guys, really, there's nothing, no transfer. Nothing much, I don't see anything. So it's passed the transfer proof, case proof and all these proof tests. Okay, and the final colour that I have is Top Notch. This is how it looks. So this is how it looks after application. Let me get back to you after a minute or two. Oh my goodness. I love this colour. I never thought I would be able to pull off this colour but it suits me so well. No liner needed. Perfect. Amazing. I, I'm hoping it picks up well on the camera. Oh my goodness. Guys, this is the colour you guys need to, to get. Like, I'm telling you right now. Like, you know, you want to go for a night out. It's the perfect reddish pinkish toned lipstick like it's really amazing i'm surprised like after it dried i'm surprised at how it looks it is amazing it doesn't look patchy in real it's so pretty wow okay let's just do the smudge proof and transfer proof test guys do you see anything i don't see I actually don't see. Kiss proof. Pass. You can wear it perfectly fine. Okay, so that's the end of my review. And if you're asking me what's my most favorite color, I think right now you'd have known. Um, it's top notch. This, the best of the best of the best. You want to go for a night out, you just wear this and bam, you're good to go. And the next color, if you want a very subtle color like for a daily wear you can actually go for salmon like you know that's perfect just one layer and you're good to go and if you prefer a more purplish kind of tone purplish pinkish tone you may actually go for fresh so i actually love this lipsticks they actually live up to its name they're transfer proof smudge proof case proof all the proofs um they're very light on the lips um except for i think the nude one i think the other three were fantastic um i love it all right everyone so i really hope you enjoyed this video i enjoyed actually trying out this lipsticks because it's my very first time and as you can see this is my ultimate favorite so uh, if you would like you can actually go check out her website i'll put the link in the description box below and you can actually make your purchases um online so thank you so much for watching and i look forward to seeing you in the next video Bye bye